Hello, sweet team. Welcome back to my channel. This is Sweet Ajele and I am back with another super delicious recipe using our leftover dinner. Do you normally get rid of your leftovers? No, no, no. We'll be using our rice to make this super delicious fried rice that I promise your entire family would love. Let's get started. To a heated wok or pan, add in some oil and break in some eggs, salt or all-purpose seasoning to taste and we'll scramble it beautifully. Once the eggs are almost well done, we're going to go ahead and get it out because we'll finish the cooking process when we reintroduce it into our rice. In the same pan, we're going to go ahead and add in some more oil. To that, I'll add in some chopped onions and some grated ginger and garlic. I'll also add in some string beans and also carrots add in some salt to taste you may use any seasoning of your choice and we will stir this until it is well combined and then we'll stir fry it for about five minutes or until it is nice and al dente vegetables have been frying now for about five minutes and when we say al dente it means it is cooked but it's still kind of crunchy so at this point we will add in our rice and I kept this rice in the refrigerator until I started cooking brought it out and it came down to room temperature I also brought out our leftover salmon and broke it into pieces so I added that as well we'll give every everything a stir until it is well combined and then we'll stir fry this for an additional five minutes so that everything will be nice and warm and absolutely delicious once that is done i'm going to go ahead and add in some oyster sauce which will take this fried rice recipe to the next level now if you don't have oyster sauce no worries you can just stay with soy sauce but i would be using both and they are both low sodium okay meaning it has less salt once you've stirred everything together beautifully taste to see if it is to your preference at this point i'll add in my soy sauce but as you can see i added and i'm like is this enough and then i added the rest it was about two tablespoons and it was perfect once that is beautifully stirred in we'll add in our red onions bell peppers i have different colors and also our eggs i added in at this time because i didn't want to add it in before adding my oyster and soy sauce which may darken your veggies and eggs but if you add it in at this time it maintains its beautiful bright color stir fry for about three minutes and then go ahead and drizzle some sesame oil over it add in some spring onions give everything a stir for about a minute and our dinner is ready the aroma pulled the kids from upstairs and they were ready to devour this my husband loves salmon so this was one of his favorite fried rice you may use any fish of your choice now all that is left is for us to serve and enjoy <laughs> thank you all so so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and are inspired to try the recipe if you do share pictures with me on instagram and i will be super happy to share it on my story i also hope that you've tried our cucumber salad recipe because if not you are missing out until i see you in the next one stay safe keep loving each other and remember that the love of god and family 
is life's greatest blessing. And guys, ke onamini uchemi sweete mahabutu. Bye y'all.